Have you seen Doreen? I'm looking for Doreen. I have not. Did she run away? I have been looking all day for her and haven't been able to find her. Oh, no. All right, guys. Danny's doing her job, being a professional. I'm over here looking at Austin Powers. I got to behave. Hey, everybody. My name is Mikey Bags of Money. I'm a full-time YouTuber and reseller. I'm about to go into a thrift store. I'm going to look for items to resell online. I'm going to show you what I'm looking for, why I like it, why I'm going to buy it, why I'm going to pass. And Danny the Niche Lady, I have so much fun. Is guaranteed so laughs profits and dutch brothers that's what this episode's all about also i'm looking for doreen where's doreen Ooh, I have something for you before you lock your car. I've been for so long. I know. <laughs> it's time to get shopped up. Let's get rocking and rolling. I'm ready. Wait, what are you? For you to put in your auction. Oh, sweet. Yep. Yeah, Birds of happiness. Your people love them. They do. For sure. Mikey, we don't have much time. They close at 4 o'clock. Mm, so we got a race. We have like an hour ish. All right. With the mini cart. Oh my god. I always get two though, because you know me. You know me. <laughs> We've got one for the top. Mm. Oh. Oh. And away we go. Pro style. Yeah. Uh, I don't have the faith, guys. I hope we just fill one. Guys, we're rocking and rolling. This place is so nice. Look at the tile floors. Oh, guys, they even got free stuff here. Free stuff at the thrift stores. Let's see if Mikey can find anything good. What is this thing? Is this a Starbucks? No, just a microwave safe. Something around here. And it'll be, oh, that's a wine glass, you guys. And the Quentin, Quintina Das Chevalis. I don't know, guys. Any of these books worth it? At home in the wilderness. Gus makes a gift. Gabby lost and found. Hand Z mysteries. Movies, free movies. You guys, I should probably take one to test with my VCR. They keep eating them and I keep getting less tapes, but free tapes, you guys. I wonder if I'm passing up any big bucks right here. There's the expensive stuff, guys. Donnie Baseball, Don Maddenly. Hmm. That guy's old. Oh, he's the Dodger manager in that one. Some Samsung VR here. A Cameron ZR500 for $100. Ah, uh, the case looks pretty good today. I got some stuff out of the case last time. Hey, there's Tom Shell. I know, Tom Shell for only $1. Tom lost his shell, and there it is. <laughs> Tom, Tom's homeless now. Ooh, is that, that looks like a repop. Yeah. Those could be good if it's Are they? if it's the real deal. It might be good if it's the repop. Mm -hmm. It could be. Ten dollars. It's not that high of asking price. I think it's like a little condiment jar with this. Uh huh. Tapon, okay, good. Hand painted, it is Nippon. That's beautiful. It's 20. Mm -hmm. Okay. Anything else in there, Mikey? No. I like the looks of those brass dealy bobs, but. Brass dealy bobs are always good. I know, the God of, God of Wreath brass dealy bob. <laughs> Sporting stuff, throwback DVD. I don't think that's an original 1970 DVD, guys. I have my suspicions. I have my suspicions. More collectibles Hot August Night, Reno 1994 soda bottle 
for eight dollars. Ooh, that purple, purple glass thing's pretty cool. It's got quite the tape job on it. I love the shape of it. Oh, the Beanie Babies. We got Beanie Babies. Guys, Dr. Evil. What did that guy say? Let's see how much Dr. Evil's going for. Austin Powers. Great movie. All right, friends, he only sells for about 20 on the eBizzle, so we're gonna have to skippy dippy on that one, but fun checking them out. Oh, they got some more Austin Power stuff here, you guys. There's a mini me. Oh, behave. Oh, behave, that's it. I couldn't remember what they say in that. That's <laughs> <laughs> the only one I know. Ooh. Yeah. All right, guys, Danny's doing her job, being a professional. I'm over here looking at Austin Powers. It's time to get moving. I gotta behave. I thought Goodwill had the good greeting card price, you guys. And then you told me I needed to go to Dollar Store. But you know what I'm telling you? Come on down to the Assistance League of Las Vegas and get your cards for 25 cents. Yeah, you guys. We're on limited time today, so we gotta keep it quick. Gotta keep it quick. Ding, ding, ding. All right, guys, that's a teapot. It's a glass teapot. I got stuff on it. only sells for about 20-ish. I had to check it out. So let's keep moving. Let's find some money. Time's, time's ticking. Danny's got all this covered. Ooh, look at that. Mugs and single cups. 25 cents and less marked. That's the deal, you guys. That is the deal. That, that gets me looking. $4 a cup? No, thank you. 25 cents? You got my attention. Right, we got some appliances, waffle makers, George Foreman, you guys. I told Supercourt we got to sell the George Foreman because I didn't get no paninis. True story. Boost dryer, you guys. What does a boost dryer do? Tested and works. That's why it just says that. Air dry systems. Boost dryer. What's, what's in here? Anything in here? Squirrel. Oh, that that holds slides, guys. Slides. No slides in there. Hmm. Boot dryer. Oh, boot dryer. It's a boot dryer, you guys. It dries boots. All right, one listed and unsold, you guys. I was super tempted. The one listed's for like 60 bucks. I mean, that thing's only for $6, but it's not like a double dryer, so... And I don't have no boots. No, really, I got my Doc Martens. If you ever seen me in my Docs? That was a good episode, but... Let's keep looking for some low-hanging fruit. Ooh, this might be low-hanging fruit, you guys. This is the phone? Let's check it out. $5, guys. $5. Gotta skip it. Miscellaneous parts. Miscellaneous parts. Nothing yet, you guys. We gotta fill the cards. Is that a bug zapper? guys i think that might be the bug zapper it was son of a son of a bug zapper they got us they got us all right guys the pickings are a little tougher here especially for mikey boy but i'm gonna keep looking keep looking so it's all about the grind i'd be looking every day the vaz vase vaz 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 vase section not much there for me either you guys last time i bought a sweet purse right off that rack right there for $15, I sold it for $75 on eBay, you guys. It was leather with red Angora. It was beautiful, you guys. I really wanted to wear it out one night, but just just didn't make it. Still not finding much, friends. Just takes one or two good ones. One or two good ones. Guys, that doll looks like it's money. And they're even like $40. That's how much money it is. $40. Vintage Vanco meter tester. It's a Vanco meter tester. Sk 
Skin tester? Ooh, guys, I'd be afraid. Afraid I'd fail. Bow wow wow yippee yo yippee yay. What do we got in here today? Pet grooming apron? <laughs> Man, I could use that. I'm the groomer at my house. Daniel in the lion's den. I don't know about that one, guys. There's definitely some fishy behavior going on in so many wrong ways. So many ways. Fancy plates, not anymore, friends. Tiger Woods, Ace Commanders, Blazing Angels, Grease, Marley and Me, Role Models, Napoleon Dynamite, Daddy Daycare. They got some good stuff in here. Cloudy with a chance of meatballs. Ooh. Let's, uh, I'll check out the games. We got two games. They're both airplane games. A lot of times these airplane people, they like to play their games and they're willing to pay up a little bit more. So $2, sell so for about 12 or 15. So that does leave me a couple dollars for profit. They're super easy to list. You just scan it, sell similar, bada boom, bada bang. Bag it. All right, guys, we got some books here. Oh, we got Garfield, Fat Book of Jokes, I think. We're gonna bag that and send that to Josie's Jazzy Junk for hanging out with us. And uh, yeah, I know you're a Garfield gal, so bag it. This almost knocked this whole thing over. That lady gave me a look like, oh, Mikey, you almost did it. Calm down. Ooh, this little slide out thing is nice, you guys. The 300, 300 was a good movie. Goldeneye. I'm really only looking for video games. Maybe you should study some more DVD bolos. You know, some anime stuff can be good. Horror stuff can be good. More of a video game guy myself. Hmm. CDs can be good. I don't even know where to look. On the real. On the real, friends. Right, let's see if we can find some bags. Ooh, 15 for a camelback. This thing's pretty sweet, but it's got a hole in it. It's a good size. Does it have a hydration pack in it? Hydration bladder is there. It's the Daystar. It's just a tiny hole, you guys. If you're a backpacker, outdoors person, that's not going to stop you. So let's run a quick comp and see how much the camelback Daystar goes for. Well, it appears it's about a $30 back backpack, and for 15 plus I have to ship it out. Mike Bags can't do that, so I'm gonna skip on that. Keep on looking. This thing's a pretty nice framed backpack right here, outdoor products. I don't see a price on it though. And it's a pain to ship, but I've shipped something similar, so I'm not afraid of that. Hmm, what else do you guys got in here? I mean, that camelback was pretty fun find. I wish I could take it home with me. I got actually stacked up on some camelbacks. Hmm. Guess we're gonna have to pass, friends. We're passing. Alright, we're moving on, friends. Some more backpacks, lamps. They had a wonderful globe last time I was here. Here's a little quick peek into the sporting goods section. Nothing, nothing standing out to me. Nope, nope. Any good golf clubs here? Doesn't look like it, friends. Hmm. Golf balls. A little sports art. Kind of helmet. Helmets can be good, you guys. No branded helmet, twenty dollars. Look at that motorcycle top for fifty. Bet you that's that's probably a good buy. Have you seen Doreen? Just like her, just like her body. Hmm. Look at that Dyson for one twenty. That thing's a beefy, beefy vacuum eater. All right, this is the men's top drawer, you guys. So I think this is their fancier stuff here. Last time this was kind of priced up. I think some stuff is on sale. I don't know. If I see something I like, I'm looking for some, some fun shirts, that's for sure. Got to add to my ever-growing collection. Short sleeve button-up shirts are my jam. 
Alright guys, missing this little thing. I kind of recognized that looked kind of familiar. Size large only. It's like looking at that. What is that? And then, boom, Lululemon. Men's pants. I saw my friend Big Dear Thrift picked up some uh, Lululemon pants. It did quite well, so I think we're going to bag these. Bag it. How did I know I'd find you in the clothes? I love the clothes. Hey, nice, nice shirt, by the way. Thank you. <laughs> a friend gave it to me. It's pretty sweet. Have you seen Doreen? I'm looking for Doreen. I have not. She ran away. I've been looking all day for her and haven't been able to find her. Oh, no. I know, I know, I know. Bad news, that one. <laughs> Very bad news. Bad news. Very bad news. Yeah. <laughs> All right, you guys. I got a unhealthy, unhealthy amount of swim trunks. I do live in Las Vegas, but I'm gonna have to pass on those beauties. As hard as it is, gotta pass. Time's ticking, friends. We gotta find some more stuff. Let's go. Are these wrestling? They might be. Or fighting? Probably worth it. My Adidas. My Adidas. Underwear. I bought underwear once. I'm still holding on to underwear. I'm never buying used underwear again. It's pretty old, but I guess not old enough. All right, guys. Went for the 50 cent t shirts, but did not work out for us. No 50 cents. We did see some nice shoes over here. Point out these wrestling boxing shoes. Let's investigate them further. These shoes could be good, like wrestling, boxing, fighting shoes definitely can be good. So I looked up the comps and they look worth it. So for 10 bones, we're gonna bag them. Okay, so these shoes are just busted out, no bottoms. I don't know if they're real. These no bottom there, just in case she's like, Mikey, you passed up some good stuff. I don't think it was, friends. Don't think it was. These are like some pony Yeezys. Pony, what are you doing? New Balance. Fresh foams. For a 10 spot. I keep running across fresh foams, but just keep to passing them. Alright. Let's check the hat section. Recently sold a hard hat I had and a riding hat to the same customer. So the, I don't know what kind of hat store they had, but thank you so much, customer. I appreciate it. Nothing cracking in the hats. Let's give a quick glance through here, friends. Quick glance. Board shorts. I keep looking at the shorts, you guys. What am I doing? Looking at the shorts. Vegas Golden Knights. Yeah, that one's a cool one. Go Knights, go. More board shorts, you guys. Ray John. Those things look kind of cool, actually. Vintage. Or just cheap. Yeah, just cheap, you guys. Super cheap. Pass on that. Then they put the single stitch in there, because that's all they could afford. Keep it moving. Right. Ooh, these look some, like some fancy kickers right here. Bruce Wayne? Does that say Bruce Wayne? Robert Wayne. Not Bruce. It's not Batman's shoe, but... So here's some scarves. Last time Carrie talked about the scarves. I haven't picked one up since. Next. No refunds, no exchanges, no negotiation, guys. No low balls. Remember that. Yep. 13 okay. minutes. Yeah. Oh out. boy. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Couldn't find the exact pair, but they, uh, they're they gonna sell for like 30 to 40 I very, so. very nice. easily, they're yeah. Very nice. All those things. I got some Lululemon pants. They're size no. large. I really wish I could squeeze into them. That's not gonna happen. I got a Garfield book and uh, two video games. I know, I got some stuff. I know, I'm pretty proud. 13 minutes, 13 minutes. Nice, are we checking out? We're trying. All right. Okay, here. going to be closed in 10 minutes. Ten minutes, ten minutes.
Have you seen Doreen? Doreen, are you in here? Still striking out with Doreen, but I found a drink. I got the employee discount. Holla! Well, I paid full price, but you know. Doreen! Doreen! Sweetie. Yes, love. Have you seen Doreen? No. No? No. You haven't seen Doreen? No. 